Okay, uh, repairing number 6180. What is it, Jip? The water pump. The water pump broke down yesterday, so uh, we checked out if it was the valves, if it was the electricity, but it's uh, just stuck. So uh, I'm gonna repair this one. We actually have two, but the other one was broken as well. So uh, we need to repair it. But Jip, what do we have? We got a new one and uh, we're gonna install it right away. Yeah, install it. We're uh, getting water right now because we're gonna go to the Rosario Islands for a couple of days. So we're here filling up the water and then we're off for a couple of days. Chilling on the beach, working on the beach instead of being here in center of Cartagena. Yep, what did you miss the most being here in the city? The uh, blue waters. So what are we gonna do? Uh, we're gonna take a swim. So, yeah, we know what it is. The boat exploded again. But, haha, <laughs> check it out. New water pump is in. Switch it on. And we've got running water again, guys. And then this is a project for later. I'm gonna make sure it's working again and then we're gonna use it to pump salt water in the boat. Well, not in the boat, but so we can uh, wash the boat down or do the dishes with salt water. So, uh, yep, another uh, little thing to put on the list because like our list is not big enough. That's our daily list. We've got a weekly list and a monthly list and uh, enough to do, but for now, that's one down. What a morning again. We left Cartagena for a good night's sleep. How was our night's sleep? Well, we didn't get much sleep. <laughs> First, we had a perfect spot, but there were a lot of waves. So we decided to go to Rosario. And then everything said that it was deep enough. And what happened? Well, it wasn't. And then we got uh, stuck with the boat. And it took us uh, four or five minutes to get out. But uh, we did it. Now it's time to sleep. We're broken. Nighty night. What a beautiful sunset, guys. We had enough of the city, constantly having the boats around us. So uh, we took the boat, filled it up with water, and for the next three days, we're gonna enjoy it here at sea. We just had a game of chess, made some pasta, now we're gonna chill, watch a movie, off to bed early because we saw a lot of lionfish today. So tomorrow, catching some lionfish and we'll be eating lionfish for lunch. Haha, <laughs> can't wait. Well, welcome to another night. It's storming and pouring rain outside and uh, I'm checking all the windows and unfortunately there's still a couple of little leaks. Yeah, we've got a little leak over here. But hey, nothing, a little pan can't help. And we've got a little drop here. So a pan underneath there, but happily the rest of the windows are sealed. Pouring cats and dogs. A lot of lightning. A lot of rain, a lot of thunder outside. <sighs> oh, broken. But happily, yeah, there's not too much wind, so. Uh, staying in one place all good back to sleep 2 30 in the morning we're rolling like an idiot uh, so uh, we've got some waves we've got the wind changing so we decided to go to the Rosario Islands another two and a half hour uh, sailing but otherwise there's not gonna be any sleep because we're rolling around like an idiot here so uh, sailing life as well Okay, so to go uh, to the Rosario Islands, you got to go through a little canal through the islands. First time we're doing this, so I'm at the front shining with a uh, flashlight. Hope it all goes well. Water isn't that. Hey, wat redden we nooit? Huh? Wat redden we nooit? Redden we nooit? Hij geeft af dit. Oké, okay, so we we didn't make it. Uh, we're stuck at the bottom. Oké, okay, we just got loose again. 
I need to go exactly the same way back. And we're stuck again. Okay. It's really shit. Our depth meter says it's 40 feet here. So now I'm going exactly the same way we got in. We waited for some waves to tip us over on the side so we got loose. Check that out. Our navigation says it's possible, but it's not. So we need to find another way in. Okay, most of the big jobs are gone. So now we're doing some finishing up touches. Check that out. This is all worn, like how do you see it? Because the sun is shining on it like every day. There is no uh, shine on it anymore. So we've got some uh, oil and check out what's going on here. Just a little bit of oil on it. And that starts to look brand new again. Haha, <laughs> that makes me so happy, guys. Okay guys, what an amazing day, but now we're back on the boat, we're gonna do some food and we got invited to uh, play some pool with some locals and they want to play for money and I haven't been playing for the last three years but I had a pool table at my home so I've been playing pool for the last 20 years so I reckon I might be able to win so next shot is us playing pool. <laughs> This is hard here to stay dry. But hey, life's an adventure. So, hey okay guys, these are the friends of Alberto. We're gonna go for a little game of pool.
Okay, guys, good morning. Fresh lobster. Still alive. How cool is that? Still alive. The other day we made a, we made a deal with the guy. Uh, buy some lobsters and here they are. Check that out. We have Alberto here. Nos otros amigo. And his other friends, brother, amigo, hermano. They're trying to do a little bit. Oh, que bueno! Oh. So having fun with the locals here, guys. Uh, so n right now the lobsters are in the freezer because if you do that uh, they will fall asleep and I, um, when you put them in boiling water uh, it's painless. So let's do it. Put them all, always head first so may they still be alive then the pain will go away instantly just like that. Let's see if he's ready. Oh that's night and nice and red buddy. Oh, <laughs> awesome. So, number two. Beautiful. Let's put some bouillon in there and the pasta. And uh, we have some fresh uh, pasta. Okay, so if you want to get the tail off, you got a little joint right here. Uh, and if you cut all around. That's a lot of meat, buddy. That's a lot of meat. Uh, because we're gonna barbecue them, uh, we wanna season them uh, then. Put the knife in the middle. We split it open. We're gonna put butter in it. Butter is still a bit frozen from the fridge. We're gonna put it in the boiling water. seasoning from Bonaire. Yeah, the local stuff. Uh, so we made our own coals. <laughs> oh, what a great job, buddy. Fresh lobster from the grill made by Yip here. We're gonna enjoy. With some fresh pasta, guys. This is just so, so nice. Mm. 